Hello, my name is John Lindemoon. I'm a cotton grower in northwest Tennessee, right on the banks of the Mississippi River. I farm here in, with my father and my family. We farm about 5,000 acres. One of the most exciting aspects of farming is the use of precision agriculture uh, that has developed in the last 20 years. We start by sampling the soil, running electrical currents through it, mapping the soils into zones so we know where to sample, where to take soil samples and where to apply our nutrients. Additionally, we use satellite images to measure the biomass of the crops, again to help us know where to go in the field to scout for insects, pull leaf tissue samples to have analyzed to know where we need to apply additional nutrients. All of this is based on GPS technology in site-specific activities. Technology has provided us a wealth of information. One thing that we do is at the end of the season, we're measuring our harvest. We have maps that are generated showing the varying rates of yield, which is a way of proofing all the various processes that we've used through the year. Is it working? Is it producing a better crop? Or is it a waste of time and energy? And by having these yield maps, we can look back and we can see exactly uh, what we've done. You've got to be computer savvy. All this stuff feeds back through the computer. It's got to be processed and analyzed and so that we can make production decisions the next day on what we've generated the previous day. That takes a more highly educated individual to help us. I have a college degree. Uh, half the people that work on my farm have college degrees. It's part of what we have to do now. One feature of cotton production is the harvest. Today I spend $800,000 to buy one picker that'll pick 2,000 acres. That picker better perform. We can't use that picker to do anything else. It does one thing for two months out of the year, it picks cotton. So let me tell you a little bit about our pickers. They're round bell pickers, I'm sure you've heard of them, and that's the direction the industry's going. It provides a means of wrapping and storing this, this cotton from the moment it's picked off the plant and hits the ground to, until it ends up in the spinning mills. It protects the cotton from the elements and in the shipping process to the gin and unpacking. We're much more productive in the number of acres we can cover a day. We pick about 75 acres a day with one of these machines but they're pretty sophisticated and it takes a good deal of education before we hop on them and run them. It takes a good deal of looking after them, much as are our spray machines and our fertilizer machines. Again, it all comes back to GPS technology, knowing where you are in the field and controlling your inputs.